the idea of the tropical is something that has been weaponized. It's something that would seem to be really benign, but ends up hurting people a lot. We had to be very upfront about it not being something that was completely innocent or just fun and colorful, but rather something that would have real life consequences. The phrase tropical is political offers us a provocation that the tropical is not neutral or naturally occurring. This exhibition helps us to engage with how the idea of the tropical and the ideas that the tourism economy uses to fuel its business have sort of reshaped the countries and regions in the Caribbean around it. So the Wikipedia exhibition is called Still Life, Still Lives, Not So Enchanted. The cruise ship, uh, the enchantment of the seas, came to Trinidad with 300 Trinidadian cruise ship workers on board. Uh, they had already been floating around in this mercurial sea for months, and then they get to Trinidad so close, and the government parks them out in the Gulf of Paria. None of these cruise ship workers were treated correctly, not by the companies and then not by the governments. There needs to be a shift and my work seeks to try and answer some of those questions and ask the question, should we treat our people like this? Should they be subjected to this? You know what I mean? And how do we expose people to a different form of tourism where it's not skyscraper hotels? I mean, these are small islands. For this exhibition, I'm showing Dark Side of the Moon, which is a video that I made a couple of years ago. So it's a combination, uh, basically a mashup between two campaigns done by the Panamanian government to promote tourism. So what I did is I connected both videos, switching the audio from both sides and showing them at the same time to emphasize the fact that neither version is a portrait of the actual Panama, but that the real Panama lies somewhere in the greens. So the, the larger, uh, I guess, subjects that the exhibit covers deal with these questions of identity, of exoticism, of how the tropics, how the Caribbean is portrayed, how it is assimilated, how it is communicated. I guess it's trying to compare versions of this vision of the, of the tropical, uh, seen through the eyes of artists who live and work in the area. There are overlapping themes uh, represented in, in some of the works. So the proximity to each other and how they play off visually, but also thematically. That interrelationship is something that I really hope that the visitors to the exhibition take away. We have young contemporary artists sort of offering us new ideas of what Caribbean-ness might be or what tropicality might be. So we have works that are not only sort of interrogating previous ideas of what the tropical is, but also proposing new ways forward or perhaps thinking what a liberatory understanding of that identity might be. And so I think that's what's really exciting about this exhibition.